Um, do you still consider Iran the largest state sponsor of terrorism? I do. Okay. Do you consider Israel a racist nation? No, I do not. Okay, that's a good start. Afghanistan, uh, do you agree that what I agree totally with Senator Shaheen that if we abandon the Afghan women who fought so hard to have a say about the future of their children, it will affect our children's future. Do you agree with that? I do. Uh, China, uh, Secretary Pompeo designated the Chinese Communist Party as having engaged in genocide regarding the Uyghur M Muslim population. Do you agree with that? Designation? That would be my judgment as well. You do agree? Yes. Yeah. We're on a good start here. <laughs> so uh, this uh, really, I, I just very much appreciate that. Do you believe that the Chinese Communist Party misled the world about the coronavirus? I do. Uh, when it comes to Turkey, the Congress has been pretty tough on Turkey mm -hmm. uh, for continuing to purchase Russian weapons and the S-400. Uh, do you believe that Turkey needs to continue to be sanctioned until they change their behavior? So I've, I've looked at some of the, uh, the, the so-called CATSA uh, sanctions. I think yes. that what Turkey has done as a NATO ally in acquiring the S-400s is, is unacceptable. Uh, the idea that a um, strategic, so-called strategic partner of ours would actually be uh, in line with uh, one of our biggest strategic competitors in Russia uh, is, is not acceptable. I think we need to take a look and see the impact the existing sanctions have had and then determine whether there's more that needs to be done. 20 years later, where do we stand regarding the fight against Al-Qaeda and ISIS? Um, ISIS, I think, actually across two uh, administrations, uh, we succeeded in taking away its geographic caliphate in, uh, in Iraq and in Syria. 